Hello YouTubers and welcome to another Disney Pixar Cars Diecast Review. And today we're going to take a look at Kabuto, the Japanese tuner car from Cars Tune Mater's Tall Tales and Cars 2. Now before we get right into the review, let me discuss something. So Kabuto is a 1999 Nissan Silvia S15 Japanese tuner car who hails from Japan hence due to his Japanese accent and was voiced by Mac Tony Kobayashi And he resembles Boost from Cars 1, which I have a broken version that I'm not going to show, but I still hope to get a replacement. So anyhow, his first appearance was in Tokyo Mater, the episode of Cars 2, Mater's Tall Tales, when Mater arrived in Tokyo, oh, and... Kabuto challenged Mater to a midnight drift race, which Mater gets modified in order to race. And, and the challenge was, and speaking of to modified, I don't have the Tokyo Mater but hopefully I would get him. So anyhow, before the race, the rules that whoever wins will become king of all the drifters and the loser will be stripped from all modifications and become stock. And so the race was on. Kabuto led most of the race and eventually made her Mater took the lead from him all the way up to the, the top of Tokyo Tower and won. And, and Kabuto was stripped and became stock. He then, he then returned in Cars 2, it, which, he, it, which he was in his tuner paint job cu customization. First, along with, and also with Chisaki, who were the two to return to car, who were one of the tuners from Cars 2 and Tokyo Mater, Mater, to return in Cars 2. First cruising on the streets of Tokyo, then at the welcoming party before the first race of the World Grand Prix. Although Kabuto, we can safely assume that Kabuto. Oh, oh, went back into his tuner customization. But what do you think? Did Kabuto re-strip himself back into his customization before Cars 2? Leave, that, leave your thoughts about it in the comments down below. So anyhow, without any further ado, let's get right into the review. Here we've got his angry, determined facial expression, his chrome silver gray paint job and his black headlights and and black and red tampo on the hood and and on the left side we've got the chrome silver rims and the red circle lining and the black fenders and the gray black and red tampos on the door and the side view mirrors and, and on the top we've got the yellow a yellow thing, I don't know what it is, and and on the back we've got the black and red spoiler, and on the back side we've got the tail lights and the invisible license plate and the exhaust boost pipe. And on the right side, similar design but completely different. 
And that is it. Now let's pull up some of the other Japanese cars. We've got... Chuki, the Zen Master Pity, and Chisaki, and some of the other tuners like Wingo, DJ, and Snotrod. And that is it. So, what do you guys think? Which Japanese car is your favorite? Which tuner car is your favorite also? Leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And if you have enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. Also, don't forget to check out some of my other videos on my channel. And cons consider the support by leaving suggestions of which car of the past from the car collection video. Should I review next in the comments down below? And view my view my channel for public watch hours. And I hope to see you guys next time for another review, so please stay tuned. Goodbye now!